Welcome to the Pit My Set of Highlights for episode number 182. The first set of the day was submitted by Cody. The the monitor itself looks like you done diddly splooged and forgot to clean. So I would, uh, you know, get yourself some Windex. No, <laughs> you get yourself some uh, water, pour it all over, and you'll be all set and ready to go. If you just turn on the monitor, I don't think you'd notice it. Would've, it. Yeah, it would have hid uh, a lot of it for sure. It's like boxes like are never a good idea. Unless they're really cool boxes, which is really never the case, uh, they shouldn't be there. Interesting setup though the walls are dirty especially in that photo you can see the underneath i guess people wear their shoes and just like track mud all over i don't know what you gotta do to it cody scored a 68 the next setup was submitted by david tom does this desk look familiar yeah it's my desk it is your desk and do you remember there being a uh, cable management slot? Uh, it's so nice to have it. It's like yeah. literally, it's like right inside. I mean, it's not the best like thing, but you can easily throw your cable. But it's better in there. than nothing. Better than it nothing. It does have a grommet hole in the back, and it is easy to use, right? Yeah. So why did you not use it? Is that a power brick or like the extension cord thing? Is that where he pl plugs all his stuff in? Well, okay, that could be the issue. Maybe that's too big. Yeah, there's no way. It but fit. but the whole idea is, especially the cables coming out of the computer and everything to that extent, should be fed through and then brought to the left side, at least coming into one big strand. He's got himself a nice pair of water speakers. Everybody loves a nice pair of water speakers. They spout out a little bit of pss, pss every time you listen to the boom, boom, you know? But he's also got a pair of like, you know, great grandma's freaking speakers there too. Now the car there to the left is cool, but I also think that it's not really the best spot for it. If anything, it should be going into the corner at an angle, not necessarily utilizing the left side, which you could be using for you know schoolwork, whatever the case may be. It's it's a bad setup. It's just straight up a bad setup. David scored a 38. The next setup submitted by Swaggy. Now he, he says the only cable he can't fix is a headphone cable. And he said everything else is perfect, but I'm not seeing the same picture as him, I think. You know, yeah, obviously that headphone cable is pretty obvious and it's not really the worst thing in the world. And if anything, you could have hit it for the photo, but nonetheless, I think that there's a little bit more of a problem with, yes, you're utilizing the Signum, that's very nice, but then it's spewing out to the left side. Again, the walls there uh, yeah. need a little bit of paint, a little bit of love. Tom's a hat guy, right? In his room, he's got a windowsill that can be covered by his curtains, but he's got like 87 different snapbacks. Yes. What do you think about something like this? Yay or nay? That's what I used to have in my old room. I used to, I hung them up just like that, basically. Okay. And I mean, it works, but at the same time, I don't like the where the level is of it. If it was high, too low, up, yeah. it's too low. You know, I think he did a terrible job utilizing the wall space here. I'm not really a fan of the thing on the right, especially behind the monitor. You know, you, ha you have sort of a whiteboard. You know, I don't think that's a great utilization there. If you have to write on the whiteboard, you're leaning over. It's just kind of stupid. So I think that would look better on the right side of the wall. And then actually putting the hats all along the back. So he scored a 72. The next setup was submitted by Nicholas. The second photo, which... I appreciate him being honest, but <laughs> what the hell, dude? <laughs> Why would you send me that? Now, the actual setup itself is obviously going off of a laptop. There's nothing wrong with that, and there never has been anything wrong with it. You're kind of running out on space because you have the PS4 there. Not really the best usability. I mean, it's not bad considering what you're working with. I just think that maybe there could have been a better solution. Nicholas scored a 40. The next setup of the day was submitted by Alec. If you guys kind of know where I stand on LEDs being shown, just kind of like right in your face, you know, not being hidden and diffused against a bowl or a surface of some sorts. It's not really the way that LEDs are meant to be used. Now, yes, I don't think it actually looks that bad in this setup. The outside of mine on the desk isn't bad. Obviously, he only has things on there that he needs, but I just feel like the cables look worse than they have to be. I think the shelf, especially the bottom shelf, is just way too high up because if you're going to put that high up, then why would you put the one above it so close to it? It's weird because, you know, the blue wall and the blue curtains and the red like peripherals and chair and all that, it looks weird, but it kind of... It, it it's like a nice red and blue theme. It, it doesn't even look that bad. Like, yeah. And it's not honestly. even bright blue. I think that's what makes it better. It's yeah, kind of yeah, like yeah. a lighter blue. No, yeah. So it doesn't look like too harsh or anything like that. Yeah. Alex scored a 70 Six. The next setup was submitted by Reese. The setup itself is kind of kind of shit. I, I don't want to hurt his feelings because he's 14, but he's using what looks to be a bandana or handkerchief of some sorts as a mouse pad. Now, the other thing that's really interesting is if you go into the corner over there, he's got an Xbox One, what looks like a DVR with the Xbox 360 on top with his Kinect camera on top. You are quite literally slowly killing your Xbox One, I'm pretty sure. I made a hole in my wall to feed the cables through. Well, that's great, except it's like shit. Like, I understand the initiative, but first problem is it's way too far down. So it's kind of like, you know. Unlike you, I like the summit. Get thing. out of my damn 
shit because i've never seen anything like that before and i just wish the fish tank wasn't there like you said because yeah. it's kind of blocking what it's saying you can still read it if you're, you're not dumb enough but what are you trying it, to say <laughs> i'm just saying it fits there like perfectly like it, it really does and uh it does I, the, it is a nice size I it's, yeah and it's like it seems like it's a cool thing that like he's probably had for a while and he's like oh i finally get to have it on my wall uh, just the stuff on the right wall that's like a little crazy, a little just weirdly placed. Yeah, no I'll idea. Just take it all down. I'd work on your setup first. <laughs> because like maybe you want a PC you've been saving up. I'd rather save up for a PC than save up for like frames or like for like your jerseys or whatever. Rescored 46. Final setup of the day was submitted by Tommy. You know, it's interesting that only one monitor's on. I say it all the time. Having all the monitors on, having a nice wallpaper makes a huge difference. I think behind the monitors, yeah, we see some cables. We see some crisscross, a little bit of this, that, and the other. But, you know, for the most part, the cable management is pretty good. Theme, it's all cramped onto one little shelf, which is, which is fine. Uh, but I think that sign, you could actually get something to adhere it above or below. I literally just think it's a simple, straight to the point setup. It's not great though. Like it's not, you know, he's getting a 90 or anything. It's just, it's an okay setup. And would you agree with that? Yeah. The one thing I would say is I would move your PS4 somewhere else. Cause you can't even, open, oh yeah. Like you can't even put your disc in or whatever. Cause it's blocked by the mic. Tommy scored 74. Alec walked away with first place with a 76. Thanks for watching the Pit My Setup highlights for episode number 182.